Hello, our dear sweet family of light. It's me, Lisa Trenton Inch Brown. And we are going to do the December energy report. Oh, it's a butterfly flies by. Coming to you from the magnificent island of Kauai. Home. Lemurian energies. And a lot of galactic ones, too. All right, so December. The words are powerful. Lots of power. And powerful transformations. Powerful clearings. Powerful um, unifications, mergings. We are going through right now a clearing of many other dimensions. Cellular memory. Old programs. Physical body upgrades. We are moving into the next phase, the 1212 gateway portal, whatever words you desire to use has opened, and we start preparing for the December 21st, I don't do dates as a rule, these are guidelines for the period and the phase that we are in. This is a very beyond powerful time. This is everyone stepping into their power again, becoming very powerful beings, remembering who they are fully as love, as light, as energy, all the other stuff that was never true, all the other human stuff, all the stories. All of the validation that many sought in the outside world. All of the belief systems that we separated off into. All of our aspects, they all have to be cleared. Now where one still has karma, there's a lot of karma clearing for those dimensions now. Um, especially with the... For sake of a word, lower dimensions, the old programs of consciousness, the old grid work. Uh, that grid work has collapsed, continually collapses. And all of this is inside your body. So for those who are noticing their body going haywire, or their physical world going haywire, or looking at the outside world for answers, you won't find it there. Uh, the answer's all inside of you. You have all of the knowledge that you need. Out there is an activation. Uh, you will seek to activate the knowledge you already hold. Um, and for those who understand, who have transcended the human journey, if you will, um, who are just clearing in cellular programs, uh, we've moved into cellular consciousness, where every cell of every particle of everything is conscious, awake, and aware. And as the body goes to wake up, um, it can't suppress anymore all the feelings uh, that were tucked inside, all of the belief systems. Um, everywhere that one has not completely become whole again within their own self as a soul. The human uses the words heal. Uh, we don't heal, we whole. And we, we come back into wholeness, we come back into love, we come back into light, and we upgrade continually. Now, December, we, we've moved recently into continual consciousness upgrades, which means that pure source light energy, pure liquid light, diamond light code frequencies, rainbow frequencies, abundance frequencies, they do not stop anymore. Pure crystalline activations of the crystalline structure. Now, the structure is inside your body. And when we start to wake up, the physical body starts to move and adjust. Physical pain starts. That's old programs clearing your body. And if you understand what's going on 
if you really want to know, if you really are involved in the process, um, it's a whole lot easier to navigate, understand, but the human aspect doesn't want to know. It wants to shut everything down. It doesn't fit into their world. And so what's happening is all of those that didn't want to know, all of those that were not, quote, ready to wake up, all of those that wanted to keep playing in the old games because it was safe or what they knew, all of that grid work inside the physical body, which is simultaneously occurring in the outside world, goes into collapse mode. And everything that held those structures in place goes with it. Now, as we come to activate in light inside, as we hold more light, as we sleep to integrate, as we get involved in the process, as we want to know more, as we start making this a priority and actually dedicate, we have to be vested in it. I mean, it's got to be important to us. And that's what is occurring for everybody as they move into consciousness. Um, now, the old way of being conscious, if you will, and because you got to understand as we come this, these things become old to us, uh, while a lot of people are just not going through them. Um, nobody's ahead of anybody. Nobody is better than anybody. Nobody, that, that isn't how it works here. Um, here, we're here to assist each other, guide each other, share, be totally open, visible, um, no more hiding. Um, that was the old games uh, that were played. We're here to be New Earth. We are to hold the vibrational frequency of love and light inside of us at all times. Compassion, respect, honor, integrity, all of those things come from inside. And we have to hold it for ourselves first. And as we do, it radiates out from inside. And that means we hold it for all others too, as one here. Now, the purification process, this will be intense for all of those still going through it. This is how it works. Um, for those who say, it's been easy, I've had no intensity, well, get ready. Because there always will be some intensity. The difference is the more light we hold, the more we are in touch with everything as energy, the less intense it is. It's intense in a different way. We're aware it's intense. We move through things energetically. Everything is energy here. And so when we look at things, we see, well, that's the energy of fear. Oh, that's the energy of pride. Oh, that's the energy of, wow, that was inside my body. Let me move that on out. Let me come back. Let me become whole again. Let me shift back into my space of love. Let me make sure that I'm not giving my power away. Let me stand in my power. Let me say no to anything that's not okay in my world. Let me move it on out. And let me open a space so more awesome can come. And this is how we do realities here. It's very easy. So when I use the word intense, um, it's different here. There's no suffering. There's nothing harsh. Things aren't falling apart in the outside world anymore. We've already gone through that within our reality as it needed to occur. Um, some will have an easier time. Uh, they didn't come here uh, to go through what a lot of us did. Um, that's beautiful. But when it comes to becoming multidimensional and walking in multiple dimensions all at one time, all at one time, everybody has to go through anchoring a lucid dream. Everybody has to go through the bizarreness. Everybody has to go through things not making sense. Everybody has to go through certain things. Uh, there's no way around that. You don't come to embody photonic quantum light in your body and your cells move around and you move from dimension to dimension in the physical waking state intentionally creating parallels, collapsing timelines and doing all of these things um, without things getting a bit bizarre. This is how it works. Um, the other dimensions, when they start to anchor in here, um, we live in a very different place. This is a completely different existence as it once was. And nothing conforms to the old ways. So, we have to be totally open. We have to stay in flow. We have to not allow. We have to choose where we focus our energy. We have to work with intention in every moment. We have to do a lot of things. And they become our natural way of being. Meanwhile, your physical body is going through an entire upgrade process. 
and it's doing its own thing. It is becoming intelligent, awake, it's clearing the imperfections, the distortions, all the things we held in our cellular memory, in our physical body. And if you can understand what's up, it doesn't have to be so intense. So, knowledge is key. Ancient wisdom is key. Being open is key. Challenging your own mindsets is key. These are key code activations. Every one of them, everything that we share is. Um, so, it's awesome. It activates the knowledge, the sacred geometry that floats around in your energy field. It brings everything in while you expand into it. And as you hold light, you walk in more dimensions until they become unlimited too. You become the entire universe again. It is many things. Uh, you maintain your higher self aspect at all times. You never step out of the space anymore. It's very different here. Okay, so December, the month of power. Powerful everything. And where you're doing the journey intentionally, where you're embracing uh, the process, where you're not holding resistance and fighting and struggling, um, it will be a whole lot easier and it's going to be magnificent uh, for those who have been doing the work. Um, beyond exquisite, beyond magical, uh, beyond magnificent, but we have to come to see those things and be those things from inside first. Everything is a gift here. Um, we function very differently. Um, and the cool part is as we become just energy again, as we let go of all the identities to anything at all, as we remember ourselves fully, uh, the entire divine essence of love and power and pure light again, everything changes. And our human aspect doesn't like change. Here, everything changes in every moment, every second. Um, nothing is the same. And we flow through realities energetically. Um, we go with it because our universe brings us everything we need. It is very easy here um, when we have purified and cleansed. As we do this, um, it's very easy. It's just an energetic process and that's it. And we stay in service, we work, we do our purposes and our missions here, all of them. There is never just one. There's many of them because we exist in all these other dimensions. And when you can remember yourselves, when you can embody all of those dimensional aspects of yourselves here, um, you are able to fulfill purposes and missions. And your body um, is going through massive genetic recoding and DNA um, restructuring, uh, molecular uh, restructuring. Um, sorry, I'm, I'm trying to put all of the words in one sentence together so it makes sense. Um, Everything is happening on an atomic level inside your body. And when you are in tune with your body, um, you are aware of what all of this is. So there's nothing wrong with us. We're not broken. There's nothing to fix. Uh, we do have to start to love our bodies. We do have to start to care for ourselves. We do have to take time and nurture and, and, and reclaim our power, um, rebuild our power from the inside out. This whole world is from the inside out. And this is how we do it. And we don't step off and leave our body anymore um, from one aspect. And then in other ways we do, but in a very different way here. And so, December, the word is power, powerful. Love yourself. Honor yourself. Stand in your power. Start shifting your world. Um, in the direction, focus your energy, stay productive, pay attention to what you're caught up in, because whatever you're caught up in is what you are creating in your world. And here we don't have spare time because every moment is dedicated to something. Every do moment is dedicated to being in service. Every moment we are busy, we're working. Uh, we don't ever stop working here, closed eyed state. Um, sleep state is uh, while well, we work in all the other dimensions consciously and, and we are aware of them we see them um, constantly expanding and moving from illusion to illusion hologram to hologram uh, we can work with the inner hologram and, and bring that one out from within there are many things we get to do here it's pretty awesome so for those who are 
open and ready, you will find that there will be moments that will be considered intense, but it is different here. As your light body activates and the energy starts running through your body and triggering uh, what needs to uh, surface and clear, triggering uh, the body to dump the old programs or, or purge in, in them, you will start to find that the purification of all of your bodies, all of your stories, all of your existences, uh, you just do them in this moment, presence, right here. I'm very aware, 360 degrees in every direction. Aware of all of the energies that are always present. Aware of the vibrational frequency. Hear, see, feel, smell, taste. Everything is a vibration. Here. Oh, the birds. I know you can hear them. And the bees. All right, guys. Um, I know I may not have covered a lot of stuff that I could have, but I will be writing every day that I can for you all as we go through this. A very huge, powerful month of, of what's going down collectively and individually. Um, I have been doing this for years. I have a massive amount of writings out there, the books, uh, the video courses, uh, the live events. Every one of them are geared towards sharing information that will help those who find them and are ready for them. Because yes, I go into the bazaar. We love a bazaar here. We love crazy. We love all of this. Because as you become multidimensional again, bizarre is the new way of being and it's quite magnificent here so i love you guys and yes i will say it glitter i'm a mermaid i love my glitter so for those of you yes the crystals uh, in our body uh, transmit a different holographic effect each time that you see us we look different um depending on, on the lighting how much sun uh, light we're holding right then dependent on the frequencies and what it can be visible because galactically, um, and I wrote on this yesterday, we are all going to start becoming visible to each other now uh, so that we can fulfill purposes and roles for the sake of transformation and the upliftment for humanity and sharing the knowledge that we bring forth and the, quote, gifts, if you will, um, that we have to share. And this is many things. Um, there's a lot to do here. So I love you. Have a magnificent everything. Um, be present in your moments. Be aware, be open, pay attention to your physical body when it tightens up, when it relaxes. Um, you want to relax your mind and your muscles. You want to recognize when to flow. You want to recognize when flow stops. You want to recognize when things are off. You want to get them straight quick. Um, you want to get back in alignment as fast as you can so your physical reality can realign as well. And before I go, I'm gonna pick up the camera and I'm going to show you the magnificent, see if I can catch it, sky. We've got some clouds rolling in, I know. It's beautiful out though. I know, I can't hold the camera very well. All right, guys, I love you. Have an amazing everything, and I will be talking to you. Come see me on Facebook on my public page where I write for everybody every day. And for those that are joining the courses with us, I love you. It's absolutely amazing. Mahalo. Stay in your sacred space.